All right, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of The Enthusiast Experiment. I am your host, Mike, and today, along with uh, pretty much every other day, we're going to look at something a little bit different. This is a microbiome kit, testing kit, from, you guessed it, Ubiome. Um, clever you, bio me, uh, I don't know. But anyways, so we'll jump into it. So this is something I found out from our good friend, uh, Tim Ferris, really cool dude, and I kind of align with him on... Um, trying to test yourself as much as you can so that way you know you know you you know kind of how you react to stuff and how your body behaves and hopefully you can um, treat it better by by knowing a little bit more about yourself so I encourage everyone to do that uh, testing on themselves maybe not <laughs> definitely not to the extent that he does but uh, through diet and exercise and really cool companies like this uh, we're starting to really learn more about who we are so I'll run through a couple of the facts per usual, and then we'll get into it and my experience with uh, the kit. So this is the five-site kit. I actually purchased three. Um, there's the other finger. Uh, so it was a Indiegogo campaign for their newest tooth kit, and they later did the five-site kit for pretty inexpensive. So I jumped on that as well, which is the one we're looking at here. And then I also bought just a gut kit um, for my girlfriend just to check it out as well. Um this kit itself is normally $3.99. I'm sorry, I don't remember the the awesome pricing that they did, but I think it was like $89 or $99 to, to do a blowout sale. So for me to get something that's normally $400, uh, you know, 20% the cost or 25% the cost, I figured I'd check it out, and I was curious anyway. So for me, it was a great opportunity to try multiple kits from these guys. I have not got my results yet, although I have submitted them in, but it does take four to six weeks for those to come in, so they're still within that window. Um, I would, I'd expect them to come in in the next week to three at the most. Um, the gut kit is normally 89 bucks, and I think I got that for free um, when I did the tooth one. I don't remember, unfortunately. It's, it's been a while ago. The, the campaign ended a little while ago. And this is the first company that's actually attempting to map the human microbiome. So that's also what's curious to me. And that's all like your, I'm going to butcher this, I'm sorry guys, but basically like your, uh, the flora and fauna of your body <laughs> would be my layman uh, definition. But they do it uh, in multiple sites, which I'll get there, sorry. And uh, man, the packaging is inconsistent. And I'll, I'll have to throw up some pictures because I don't have everything, unfortunately. But I did try and take pictures of a lot of the stuff. Um, so there's supposed to be an insert in here, which there was not in two of the three that I purchased. And that's kind of annoying because on the site, they use that as a platform um, for certain tests and tubes and stuff, which I'll get into in a second here. And then just to point out, um, it's also painless, right? So like, I think the biggest point is which I'll just go ahead and start getting into it here. But the biggest point for me is that instructions were nil, if any. It was it's very frustrating. Um, so when you open up the package, a lot of the tubes are gone, obviously, because I've gone ahead and submitted my my samples for testing. Um, but here you can go is the top of the simple packaging that it comes in, which I don't mind at all. And you can see it explains uh, a couple of the different test sites here. And I'll leave that here just for a second for you guys to check out. You can pause the video to read them if you want. And then over on this side, we got the other ones. So you can see there's uh, a few different areas that you can actually test. And all of them, again, are painless. I do want to point that out. Some people may be a little worried to do this kind of sampling or testing on themselves because they're f for fear of there being any kind of pain associated. There's nothing. Literally, you're just using these, which are their uh, sterilized cotton swabs. And uh, you can kind of see it. It's like basically a huge one-sided Q-tip. And you just uh, dip that in this, oops, sorry, which is sterile water. And then you rub it around the site that is applicable for your test. And as you can see, there's supposed to be a little tray here, which if you go to the website, I'm sure you'll see a little plastic tray that holds all of your tubes. Uh, in this case, it would be six because they always give you one extra. And then there's a couple of holes here where you can put your uh, sterile water so that you can swab into it without getting stuff. Both of mine didn't include that. My girlfriend's did. Again, the inconsistency in packaging is a little frustrating, um, especially when it's something as small as that. And the only thing that's included is this guy. So we'll start here. You can see 
um, why they've included the spare tube, which I do think is a great idea and on their part a really good way to get an upsell because uh, you could test an additional site for a charge. That's really smart on their part. Uh, they do have questions and support section here and then welcoming you. And on the back, letting you know there's only three simple steps to sample. You got to sign up, register your kit, very obvious. Uh, you do your sampling and then you ship it to them. While this seems simple, there's no descriptions in the box or in the area here. You do have to go to the website to learn how to test each region. And a lot of the information on the site is not that great. I would rather have another one of these cards or this card on the back have a quick breakdown of how to do the samples in each area. I understand you have to go online to register your kit, but it would still be nice to have all of that stuff here. Because when you're in your bathroom or wherever you're doing your sampling, you have to lug your laptop around. Or if you have a desktop, like then you have to take your sample over to there. But you want to be like in a sterile environment. And it just it didn't seem that well thought out. And on the tooth kit, which I do not have here, comes exactly the same as this. Um, but on the website, their directions were completely non-related to the tooth kit. So that was really frustrating because you don't use one of the cotton swabs. They actually provided what looks like if you've ever used those, if you have braces and they have those dental floss Christmas tree looking things that you can use to clean in between your braces. They basically just included that in the kit instead of this. And the online instructions didn't tell you how to use that. So I had to make it up. Um, and I posted something on my Instagram account. And like two weeks later, they finally reposted a comment to my original comment about how you're supposed to do it and that they updated the instructions. But for them to do that so far after the kit was released is really, I don't know, man, for a company that's doing testing, that's just not a good look. But anyways... I'm still excited about the, uh, the overall product itself and the results. It's just really hard for me to give any kind of a recommendation, especially on this kit. That's normally $400 when it's not. It could be so much sexier, guys. Um, and you could really do a lot to make this an exciting experience instead of like what you see before me. Um, it did come, again, it came with, I think, maybe two extra of these. So you had six swabs total, one for each two because you had five test sites and one spare. And then the sterile water um online instructions were still just like kind of blah i don't know i just i wish they would hire maybe a designer or something to come in and just jazz that stuff up and really make it an exciting experience that you know instead of underwhelming uh if you guys are really curious about this let me know in the comments below i'll do a follow-up video with my results if i get enough interest um, but i appreciate you all swinging by i i give this a pass for now We'll see how they improve in the future, but it's just really hard for me to recommend something that has such a high barrier to entry cost-wise and a semi-lackluster presentation, I guess. But again, uh, thanks for swinging by. I would really appreciate it if you guys liked, shared, subscribed, um, and with your fellow enthusiasts so that we can grow this thing together. But hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry it wasn't as super exciting as some of the other ones, but, you know, in the, uh, the vein of continual testing. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll talk again soon.